Today, the Crown Court acquitted head race team engineer Maximilian Ollander of all manslaughter charges in relation to the death of Ollie Magnussen 25 years ago. He is remembered as one of the sport's best drivers to have ever competed. New forensically acquired evidence has been opened. Get out! Ollie! 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 Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out now! How's the doctorate going? Any nice boys? Mum, there are no boys doing PhDs. The men are either OCD, gay, or don't wash. <sighs> How's Dad? Don't tell me. He's out celebrating the end of the trial. Not that he needed to worry. Um, but Dad... Well, your father... Well, he has... Mum? Well, I didn't want to tell you this. Because... Well, because things are going so well for you. But... I thought it was just a phase, but... Now I'm really worried. He does not himself. And I don't know what to do. So I called you, and... Uh... Please help you, Dad. Don't worry, Mum. I'll get the old fart to lighten up. You must be starving. Go sit down. Where's Dad? Mr. Eckhart. Long time no see. Very true. You've grown so much since last time. How old are you now? 15? 16? <laughs> You're here for your father. What's Dad done? I'm busy. Didn't think you turned into a nostalgic old man when I was gone. What's going on here? Maxine, what are you doing here? When have you been back? Is your mother here too? No, she isn't. I got back two hours ago. Had a good night last night. Yeah. You know, I think everyone's gone a bit crazy. Mum, she's worried about you. What are you doing with these? Donating them to the museum. Maxime, I'm busy. Should go home. What? I just got here. I haven't seen you in months. Just go home. Talk to me. Please. What's going on here? Max? Max? Mr. Eckhart sent me. 
He wants me to go back to the old gearbox. I can make up for the time we lose. I'm comfortable with the old box and we're just too unreliable right now. We need points. Holly, I didn't bring you to gather a few points. I brought you to win. And I will forever owe you, but man. No, Ollie, listen to me. You have a gift. Give me a bit more time and I will create a car deserving of that gift. And then you'll fly. Ollie went back to Mr. Eckhart, convinced him to use my new semi-automatic gearbox. That weekend he died. He knew the risks. They all do. It's what they sign up for. It was my fault! Build a death trap. And no one's held me accountable. So I will. What? The court acquitted you of all charges. If you don't believe them, I'll prove it to you. What is going on? Mum, Dad is... He's doing better. Really? Is he coming home? No, not tonight. He does miss work, that's all. He'll be home soon, I promise. I'll see you in a bit. Bye. I'm sorry, I, I should have seen this coming. I, I hope you're okay. I want copies of all the CAD designs in his office. That's privileged information. I need the designs. I need to prove to him it wasn't him. Investigators have gone through everything twice if they couldn't find anything. Fuck you, James. Go to hell. What are you up to? Just uh, uni work. Just trying to get a head start. Mum, what was Dad like after the accident? It did hit him. Just like everyone else. Yeah, sure. But what got him through it? Well, we had you two months later. <laughs> that changed everything. I mean, he wanted a boy, so... No <laughs> shit. <laughs> Sorry. Claire. Sorry to pop by so unexpectedly. Um, Maxine wanted uh, these It's my uni project. Designs. The one I just started. When the accident happened, my father prevented an internal investigation. Obviously, he didn't anticipate forensics shedding new light on the incident after 25 years. His intentions were good. He didn't want anyone blaming themselves, but that was a mistake. And it has come back to haunt all of us. My father never really recovered from Ole Magnusson's death himself, and. I was too young to help him. It tore my family apart, and I can't let that happen to yours as well. Thank you. Mm, don't thank me. This won't fix him. People don't work like machines. VP102, the world's first F1 car with a semi-automatic gearbox the accident was deemed a freak after an official investigation by the governing racing association. Forensic evidence, however, claims the gearbox caused the car's evidence batteries to fail and inconclusive, but shows no intentional negligence from the engineers. The case is closed.
Fee. Good morning, Dad. You seem to have slept well. Why is that? See, I stayed up all night trying to prove to you that Ollie's death wasn't your fault. Didn't ask you to do that. Didn't tell me it'd be a waste of my time either. One thing. Is there even a photo of us together in this office or at home? Maxime, you don't understand. I do. See, you always wanted a boy. You just never told me you had one. It was him. He was your surrogate son or whatever the fuck he was. How could I ever compete with a dead man? He could have had his own family by now. I took that away from him. I brought him to this team. Built the car. I convinced him to race. You had me. Please. Say something. Maxime, what happened? I lied. Dad isn't doing fine. I tried to help, but I can't. He needs help. <sighs> Don't worry about him. He'll, he'll, he'll be okay. Sorry for dragging you into this. Mum, he needs a therapist. Please. He wouldn't want that. He's a stubborn man. Is that why you haven't gone to see him yet? What are you accusing me of? When was the last time you asked Dad how he felt? Mum, he needs help. And a real doctor. And he needs us.